Okay, guys, um, I'm packing. I'm packing for Aspen and, uh, well, packing meaning <laughs> deciding what I'm gonna take with me to Aspen. I'm going there in a few days. I never be there. Uh, I'm gonna ski for two days. But basically going for four days, but uh, two of them are full days and uh the day we're arriving and the day we're leaving so obviously i'm gonna um, not only ski i'm gonna explore the town uh probably we'll be shopping at least window shopping and so i'm basically gonna show what i'm planning to take with me well by the way any suggestions uh welcome especially if you've been there before I started, I'm gonna show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing my Kate wide jeans, which I'm planning to take with me and cos top, like polo top, whatever you call it. My Tiffany bean necklace, which I bought pre-loved. Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying, um, to wear a headband. I bought it in CVS and uh, so far I think it looks good. Okay, I'm gonna start with outwear. And yeah, for going only like for basically two full days, well, okay, four days, um, I'm taking three pieces of outwear. I know it's a lot but it's more about of having choices because i'm not one of those person who um decides what outfits to wear every day i need to have options because i might change my mind i mean especially in the places i've never been before so i might get different vibe uh from what i thought i'm gonna get or whatever just a mood changes so I am taking three outwears. I'm not gonna try them on because then it's gonna be too long. Uh, obviously I'm gonna vlog from Aspen and I'm gonna show you my outfits um, in Aspen vlog. So stay tuned. And also I will be posting my daily outfits on uh, Instagram. Okay, so I'm taking this Maxmara coat, of course. I mean, going to Aspen and not taking this coat if you have it. I mean, I think it's a crime. Uh, it's basically blanket and I am planning to travel with it because I'm kind of uh, too, too bulky, even though it's light, it's too bulky to pack in my suitcase, which is over there. I'm taking the biggest suitcase um, I have. And um, uh, by the way, I'm not taking my Louis Vuitton carry-on this time. I don't know. I'm kind of like tired of it. I always take it, so I'll 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 take something else. Um, so no Louis Vuitton carry-on for me this trip. Okay, so first coat I'm taking Max Mara. It's basically gonna be blanket, and now when I wear it as a blanket on a plane, it's very light to carry on but at the same time it's bulky to put it in a in the um suitcase okay my next coat controversial it's a fur it's a real fur but it's vintage fur uh it's actually yeah fur is vintage it was my mom's coat uh, it was a long, long mean coat. She, my my father got her very, very, very long time ago, very long time ago, like literally maybe before I was born. And um, so I took it to the fur, fur uh, tailor, if you can tell it. And we totally reconstructed and made it to the short, short coat and um, 
um, more modern design. Um, so fur itself, it's vintage and it's my mom's, but coat, uh, the model of the coat is um, new. Um, I have very conflicted thoughts about wearing this coat because I, I hesitate to wear it in New York. I don't think I will. No, I wore it in New York. Uh, I wore it in New York when I just made it, um, but um, I'm kind of hesitant to wear it in New York for, I do feel uncomfortable there wearing um, fur coat because you're not gonna put a sign on it that it's vintage and uh, people judge you. Um, but I feel like Aspen, I mean, if you're gonna wear fur coat, uh, you're gonna wear it in, places like Aspen um, and uh, yeah let's see it's very warm and uh, <clears throat> I'm not gonna get rid of it ever for many reasons first of all it's my mom's and my mom passed away second of all it's a beautiful coat and I'm not gonna waste it and um, Okay, moving on, and another coat, which is this Lululemon Popper white jacket. I bought it because of the color. I needed white puffer. I'll tell you why when I move on to my shoes. And this white, like, um, I wanted specific white. Not every white suits me. So this kind of, it's still white but it's not like cold white and it's warm and it's, um, I might even ski in it. I do have ski ski outfit from North Face, but um, I might ski in it too, why not, you know? And that's, uh, that's uh, kind of coat you wanna wear when it's snow around and I'm transitioning to the shoes I'm taking with me and I'm gonna show you the shoes why I needed white coat for. And I do not wear the shoes unless I'm going in ski resorts. Um, and this Chanel, I got them on, I got them on um, sale. And good thing about it, they have that pokey, I mean, it's a device if you can tell, it has pokes here. It's actually, I should, it's very good to walk around in the ice, on icy and slippery areas. So it's, it has a device, you take it out and turn it and then hide those pokes. If you don't need it, I have to find the device because right now I have pokes out. So very warm and, uh, I'm gonna wear them a lot in Aspen because I don't tend to wear them anywhere else unless I'm on a trip for ski. Yeah, I have to actually clean it, the sole. But with them very long, very long time ago and there are this nice shiny material and um, it's um, very warm and it's navy blue. Okay, since I moved down on shoes, I'm gonna show you all shoes I got. I came across these um, Inuki, I, I, I hope I uh, pronounce it correctly, Inuki boots uh, a couple of years ago, but um, they, I never saw them in black or if I saw them in black, they were uh, suede. So when I saw these on, um, believe, Metaporte or my Teresa, and they were on sale, they were like on sale for like two hundred something dollars. I grabbed them because I knew I'm going to ask him. But what I didn't pay attention to, uh, it was a badge boot. You don't see a badge from here, but this the insert was there, so it kind of lifts you up which I absolutely don't need and don't want. 
but uh, luckily this you could took this out and i just ordered on amazon this shiveling inserts so that's what i'm gonna put it in there for worms i mean it's all shiveling lined except the bottom uh, bottom of the shoe which um was lined with this so i'm gonna just line this with this um very calm it's some alternative to uggs something different from uh, from uggs and i feel like it has a better sole non-slippery sole because I noticed that I sleep in some of my ox boots sometimes. I don't know why. Um, yeah, so this is another one, uh, another pair of boots I'm taking. I didn't decide, I think I'm gonna travel in these two. Uh, yeah, they go well with my Maxmara coat and uh, they're cozy to travel. And one more pair of boots I'm taking, this more or walking around in a, in the town, maybe maybe going in a restaurant. I check all dress codes in the restaurants are pretty much smart casual. Um, and uh, what I like about this boots, first of all, they this kind of sole, you know what it's called, and it kind of goes well with my Maxmara coat and it goes well with this. Is a touch of beige brown goes well with my coats and uh, they are not as casual they are casual boot but they're not as casual as this one so this is basically what to go to the restaurant and um i'm uh planning to wear them with jeans even with those jeans my kid jeans because it's a quite elevation here so my jeans are not gonna be dragging on the floor and but would they look very well with uh with also with this ble black new jeans from agolde i recently got i already wore them a lot but i like it has a little bit tailored look because of the pocket um it's actually the same pocket as here and not typical it's not typical jean pants pocket so it goes very well with this and now i'm showing you my pants i'm taking with me but also with this a golden i'm like a golden ambassador <laughs> a golden leather pants which i am planning to wear to the restaurant okay um also from the bottoms i guess i'm showing you bottoms right now i'm taking this totem leggings which are very thick and it has um the zipper inside and it basically goes with every single boot i'm taking um Again, sorry for the lighting, it's like three o'clock. I know I'm, I'm shooting in at the wrong time of the day possible when sun literally shines, but this is the only time I have. And, uh, and it basically goes with every single outfit I'm wearing. Um, okay, so moving on on the tops. Obviously guys, I'm not gonna show you every single um, thermal or top I'm gonna take like those I'm just only showing you more kind of fashiony clothes especially I'm gonna show you this 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 is from Kos it's like basically you put it you can put it on any single um this one I'm gonna show you this over and it works as a cape as a scarf as a extra layer uh, this is new sweater i recently got from totem and it looks amazing with this black leather pants so it's going to be basically outfit um i will be wearing in restaurants and it also looks good with those jeans and with those leggings 
Okay, another sweater I'm taking with me. By the way, I have to fix it because it kind of just, I don't know how that happened, but my favorite um, weekend Maxmara top, which very appropriate for skiing. I'm not gonna ski in it but for ski for a ski trip, for walking around the ski town. And um, basically it's perfect for mountains. Also gets, goes very well with every single bottom I'm taking with me. And um, another sweater I'm taking, which I don't wear enough. I feel like this Celine, sweater hoodie uh, for more casual strolling around the town vibe um, what else um, I'm also taking with me I just got it from cleaners I might even travel in it it's more for a lounge it's Lily Silk famous set every single vlogger <laughs> Has, and I got influenced as well. I got influenced by Nuri and Tamara. Very nice, um, loungy type of set. I think I showed you that before. And I might travel in them. In these also. What else? What else? What else? Um, I'm taking um, this hat, which is new. I bought it specifically. It's 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 brand called Unsus Unsubscribe. Actually, I don't know if it's a uh, brand Unsubscribe, but I bought it in that store called Unsubscribe, and it's like goes I think well with my Maxmar code, and oopsie. Also, I mean I know what the weather gonna be, but. You know, 35 degrees in Aspen could feel totally different than 35 degrees in um, New York. So I'm taking also this Ugg uh, gloves, which I'm also planning to wear with my Maxmara coat. What else? Um, I'm taking bathing suit. Uh, this is a new baby's bathing suit. I also got it in that store called Unsubscribed. That's maybe that's how you recognize the brand. Uh, and it has very unusual top. It was very, it basically goes off a little bit over the shoulder. And what else? Oh. What I'm taking with me, I'm taking this scarf. This is not, this is actually cost scarf. Um, I bought it because it uh, reminds me Acne Studio scarf and I'm planning to wear this with this coat. And uh, now I'm gonna move out on the beds I'm taking. So my main bed around the town gonna be this a mess. Uh, Kelly goes well with this coat, with basically every coat, but more this and her coat. And for my all white outfit, I'm taking my new Chanel, as many of you suggested. It's a little bit different white. This is more creamier than the coat, but it's okay. Before I got this one, my plans were to bring this one with me. Let me move away from sun a little bit. Um, and but as you can see, this is wider than this, so I'm going to take this one. Also, I'm taking those two belt bags. That's basically for the slopes. So this for this coat. If I'm skiing in this one, I also have Lululemon um, belt bag. So I basically put all necessities for slopes, money, ID, everything I need, phone, uh, whatever here. And that's how I'm gonna ski. Also, I am taking my two Celine tops. 
just to have a layers despite thermals thermals i'm gonna wear on ski slopes but i also like to have uh my uh t-shirts uh wearing under the sweaters in case i get hot i take sweater off and i have very nice t-shirt under and i'm taking these glasses with me those pearls can you imagine with this coat let me let me try this coat for you Go. Little sneak peek of outfits. Um, Hi guys. So it's um second day and I got abruptly interrupted filming video yesterday. So couldn't, um, basically I mainly finished the video. I had nothing else to show you, but I didn't say proper goodbye uh that's what i'm doing now i'm also showing you uh, my a uh, new um if still around glasses uh which i forgot to show you and i'm also gonna take them probably with me mm, to aspen i got them on sale and i like the shape and it's very subtle logo and also i'm wearing them right now because i look awful I have absolutely no makeup on and basically I came on here first of all look at this Zara cardigan which I have for ages it's one of my favorite Zara purchases very warm very cozy um, okay so I'm gonna say goodbye here and I'm going to see you in my next um, video from Aspen. Um, if you are not uh, subscribed to me yet, consider subscribing. Uh, don't forget to press that bell notification button uh, so you get notified every time I post a video. Follow me on Instagram, the same name, Love Me Some Lux. Um, uh, I will be posting a lot on Instagram and stories from Aspen. I feel like it's the easiest uh, way um, to do. And uh, what else, what else? I guess that's it. I wish you all the best and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.